This video will show you how to find the number of years in a future value annuities problem. This video assumes you've already watched the video annuities finding future value and so you know how to get to this screen and have some basic understanding of how to do annuities future value. Because in this problem you put hundred dollars per week in a savings investment that earns you 7.6 percent per year that's what the slash A is, compounded monthly. So part A, how long do you have a million dollars? So it's a hundred thousand. Let's make it a million. How much did you spend? And how much did you earn? So let's first figure out how long it's going to take at a hundred bucks per week to make a million bucks. So start with N. And that's what we don't know. We're trying to find the number of years. But we start with it. And remember, that's what we're finding. Our interest is 7.6%. Our present value is zero. We assume we start with no money or it's just zero. We're not going to use it. But we're going to make payments of 100 bucks. And the $100 is negative. Use the white minus button, not the blue minus button. Our future value, that's going to be a million dollars. We want to find out, N, how long is it going to take to get a million dollars? One, two, three, four, five, six zeros. Our payments per year, we're making weekly payments and there are 52 weeks in a year but our interest isn't weekly, our interest is compounded as it says in the problem here, compounded monthly. And we'll assume since it didn't say that our payments are at the end of the period that we pay, so at the end of the week. So we've got everything set up and now we go to N and we solve it using alpha enter solve and we get 1884 but remember these are payments per week so for part A, the number of years is equal to 1884.77, which is approximate. That's the number of weeks. And we'll divide that by 52. We'll need to get out of here. So second mode to quit. And we'll do $1,884.77 and divide that by 52. And what we get is approximately 36 and let's round to how about two decimal places this time 36.25 years or about 36 years and three months so that's how long it'll take to have that million dollars part B is how much did we spend well let's go back to our TVM solver apps enter enter how much did we spend well we made payments of a hundred dollars and we did it 1884 point seven seven times so we'll round to let's round that so our amount spent equals how many payments did we make one thousand eight hundred eighty four let's round that to point seven seven obviously you don't make point seven seven of a payment but you would have made that decimal that fraction of a payment on that last payment so we'll round to two decimals there I put an approximate dot and then we'll multiply by a hundred which is nice, because the math works out really easy, you don't need a calculator, just move the decimal two places over. We spent $188,477, which is pretty sweet when you think about it, because we earned a million bucks. And so when we go to calculate how much did we earn, that's part C, we're just going to figure out how much we had at the end, which we can say it was a million bucks and two three four five six zeros minus how much did we spend hundred eighty eight thousand dollars four hundred seventy seven and so the difference between that I just subtract let's quit out of here second mode a million bucks make sure you got six zeros there there they are minus hundred eighty eight thousand maybe you could do that in your head without the calculator you get eight hundred and eleven thousand five hundred twenty three dollars therefore we earned or you earned eight hundred and eleven thousand dollars five hundred twenty three or eight hundred eleven thousand five hundred twenty three dollars that's amazing right that's why it's so good to save money so start saving now